So again, another lesson in how not to fuck up your company. Yeah. Speaking of companies that fucked up, Telltale sucks, huh? I want you to tell me the telltale tale. I'll tell you the telltale tale. The telltale tale of the telltale. Yeah. So, uh, you know, telltale. 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 So they kind of revitalized the um, graphic adventure. So the old, um, like the old King's Quest style games. Yes. yes. Very story driven, puzzle solving. Uh, not a lot of action. Yeah. But. They did that with like, were they the ones that took like took charge of like the the uh, Borderlands one and the um yeah is the, they, is it they the did Batman a Batman one? yeah the first big oh. one was the uh, Walking Dead Walking Dead mm-hmm. that was the first big one they also started off with the uh, Back to the Future one I think yeah that yeah was the first one that really they have a lot them. of them then um, it was shortly after that there was Back to the Future there was a Jurassic Park one which wasn't well received but um, I didn't realize like. I knew there was. Oh, then there was. Uh, was it Wolf? Is it Wolf Among Us? Yeah, Wolf Among Us. Yeah, yeah. that's a cool. Cover. And uh, they were doing Minecraft stories. So like, okay, man, they're a busy team. They were in a ton of crap. They had a ton of licenses. They sure do. And uh, I guess they got in a little over their head. Mm. And I guess they got um, a bit of the EA attitude as far as <laughs> um, they think their company is the shit and you should be privileged to work here and as much as we shit on you you should be thankful that you even get to walk through these doors it's kind of the the attitude that uh, a lot of the employees were starting to complain about where are they based out of you know uh i I want to say california but i'm not sure okay but um so all of a sudden they said uh everyone showed up for work and they gave everyone i think it was either 30 minutes or 60 minutes to get out. Everybody leave. So like everyone just showed up and there was no warning, no nothing. Just grab your shit and leave. Why? Lock the doors. You're going to hire new talent? And ran out of money. Oh. Closed. Wait, Telltale's gone? Gone. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't they um, do Sonic 3D Blast? I think they did. As Telltale? Like that was. No, Traveler's Tales. <laughs> uh oh. Okay. There was a tail in there somewhere. Yeah, Telltale wasn't that round, but still. Yeah. I got the tail. I got half of them. Right. You knew all those. You knew all the games they've been doing. And they um, they kept one team on, a team of like, I think it was like 18 people. And then they tweeted a couple of days later, nope, we're out too. <laughs> it <was> apparent, <laughs> they the were person. in charge of maintaining the Twitter account until. <laughs> yeah. Well, they uh, I guess they were a team that was in charge of the next mine, Minecraft story. I guess they were under contract. How have, how do they run out of money when they have so many big licenses and publishers to work with them? I don't understand that. I think they were paying big bucks for this stuff, and it, uh, it was the last oh. game. One game, last game that came out did not do well at all. I think the Batman one didn't do so well, and there was another one. But they were just hiring these huge teams to crank out all these all these games um that weren't they just weren't selling in the droves yeah. that they had to yeah and uh without any warning they just they just closed it up and it sucks because like there was there were some people that had just started working there for a week and they had traveled across they moved across the country to get this nice swanky job with with telltale and there's no severance packages they can't even sell off any ips to make the money back because they don't own any they don't own any all licensed yeah they don't have anything to sell everything was licensed (laughs) so they're just gone they're gone Mm -hmm. they just gotta those people just gotta move on to put them on their resume and look for work Mm. right and there's already uh who was it someone was picking up some of the teams i I forget but i mean 
same thing when uh, 38 Studios closed up like that and everyone just, you know, the whole building was just escorted out at the same time and, you know, a bunch of companies stepped up and hired a bunch of those guys. So people that kind of feel bad for them are, are trying to scoop them up. So, uh, yeah, it's a mess. It's gross. It's like the, you know, worst tragedies of, uh, you know, gaming companies since 38 Studios. It certainly is a tale to tell. It is. The tale of telltale has been told. <laughs>